It's your girl Naomi, and I'm back with another banger. And I say that because every video that I drop, every video my kids drop, it's gonna pop, okay? So click that like button, that subscribe button, cause we popping, and we ain't stopping till we reach the top. Y'all heard me? So today, y'all, it's gonna be another episode of Cooking with Naomi. Y'all, we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna cook. We're gonna saute salmon. We're going to be eating uh, sour cream and chives, mashed potatoes with it, and steamed broccoli, y'all. So I'm gonna be showing y'all how I cook my salmon, how I saute it down. Um, first, these are the seasons that I'm using. I got salmon seasoning, y'all. I got uh, what is this? Garlic powder, paprika, chili powder onion powder and creole seasoning y'all so i use one tablespoon of each season i put it into the bowl i stirred it all together and i'm gonna pour this over all of the salmon um that i have in this pan i had a big old salmon y'all and i just divided it into sections so it'll be enough for everybody and it's probably gonna be enough for us to eat for tomorrow so first you want to just dab a little bit of oil on it uh -oh. olive oil Huh? Olive oil. Yeah, this is olive oil, y'all. I wish I had that little fancy thing that the chefs use. Um, but you know, we're gonna work with what we got till we get it. No, you know you that gotta, you gotta you gotta no, hold on. You gotta mix it all up. You just can't pour it on the you gotta Okay, well then show you gotta me. massage <laughs> you gotta massage massage it in, massage it okay, in. Okay, yeah, he you gotta right. hit both sides now. Hit all both right. sides. Well, he's the pro. That's my boyfriend, y'all. That's Pua in the back. You gonna tell him, hey? Hey, y'all. How y'all doing? <laughs> he better. He's a pro at cooking, y'all. I'm um in between. Too. I'm in between pro and a uh, beginner. I can cook, but I I, I still got to learn how to cook, cook. So you want to hit front and back sides with the oil before you put the seasoning. Do y'all eat salmon? Comment down below and let me know if y'all eat salmon. I love salmon, y'all. It is so good and it's so healthy for you. It got so many uh, nutrients and stuff. I definitely recommend y'all to try it if y'all haven't. You just want to rub it on there. Give it a good massage. Show your fish some good love. <laughs> That's what we're doing right now. We're showing it some good loving. You know, everybody needs a massage, even fish. <laughs> uh oh, okay, that's enough. See, that's why I need that little oil thing uh, that the shelves have. That way I won't be pouring too much. So I hope this come out right, y'all, because it this is a lot of oil. Okay. So now I'm gonna turn it back around because I wanna season it first. Uh, well, I could have seasoned it that way, but okay. Let's pull half and then flip it over and hit it with the other half. Uh, you can do that. Mm -hmm. You want to make sure you get every spot with this seasoning, y'all. I did it like this because I don't, you know, with fish, you don't want to season it too much. So instead of me just, you know, using each can, uh, I just did one tablespoon of each and stirred it all together, you know, because you don't want your fish to be too salty. We eating healthy tonight, y'all. This is going to be real good. Then I'm going to make the, uh, the sauce from scratch. You know, when you use the heavy whipping cream, the butter and then you season right, it down good. and you pour that's it good, that's good. You don't want it too salty. oh yeah and you pour it over your that's fish good. and your mashed potatoes no no no, no. you gotta massage it in oh there you go massage it in <laughs> oh look i'm moving too fast y'all yeah, you sure will <laughs> Wait to eat. What y'all cooking for dinner? Let me know. I'm sorry, yeah. Let me know in the comment section what y'all cooking for dinner. I'm over here drifting off. <laughs> Both. All right, so now 
We got it all rubbed in like Pooh said. So now we're gonna flip it over and do the do it to the other side. Hit the back side. <laughs> What do y'all season y'all fish with? Do y'all season it with uh, the same stuff that I use? Not too much. I got this, sir. Okay. All right. <laughs> be salty. Don't say nothing. Nah. It's not going to be salty because I'm going to rub it in. <laughs> there you go. That's how you want your fish to look, y'all. This look well seasoned already. <laughs> look weird. <laughs> it look weird. Come uh, on. We might use the rest of this seasoning for the broccoli. Cause we don't want that to uh this seasoning to go to waste. Yeah. So I'll just pour the rest. You're gonna need something for the whipping cream too, huh? Uh yeah. Oh, I just, yeah, I put the rest into the whipping cream. Hey. All right, y'all, so we're going to go ahead and put the potato, I mean, I said potatoes, the broccoli in because the water is boiling. Ooh, Ooh that water hot, y'all. Got to put it in here carefully because I don't want the water to splash on us. Up in here, and we're just gonna let this cook on down. Okay, so I'm able to I'm able to put four in here at a time. So I'm gonna let that cook on down, y'all. And then as it's cooking, when I turn it over, I'm gonna show y'all how uh it's supposed to turn out and how many minutes to cook yours for. Give them a close-up of how it looks. As you can see, it's starting to sizzle. So, yes, you see it's cooking, y'all. So, I'll be back to y'all in a minute. All right, y'all. So, I flipped it over, and this is how it's looking. I said I let it cook for five minutes on the first side, and this I would have been cooking for like a minute and a half. So, I cook it uh, three minutes on the opposite side, y'all. And this is how I like my fish to look uh, as it's cooking. This is not burnt. It's it's a crisp potato. You know you want to make sure it's um cooked on the inside fully. Okay, y'all. So the second batch is done. Some of it uh had broke apart, but that's fine because it's still gonna get eight. But um, I would say three minutes on each side, y'all. I know I said five minutes, but. You could do it five minutes if you want to, uh, mm -hmm. to do crispy, but I did like three minutes on each side. And that's how mm -hmm. I got it looking like this. Trying this kind, so we're gonna see how it tastes. Try it, try it. 
We're gonna call this episode Cooking with Naomi and Pure. <laughs> Since Pure are helping. Now nah, this way. All right, look how it's looking. Okay, I can see the chives. We're gonna see, does it taste like sour cream? You gotta make sure you get all of it. Mm-hmm. And then, uh, I add milk, butter, and seasoning to mine. Uh, what we add? Creole seasoning? What else do we add? We're going to hit with the, uh, the milk and the butter then. Yeah, it's thick. Mm-hmm. Let me go ahead and get the milk. Okay, so let me know when to stop. That's fine. Who want to make his mashed potatoes real good, y'all? I like how he make his. I like mine creamy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. So we got that milk up in there. So we're going to add some butter. Let's get all this Let's out there. We got to mix that bad boy Yeah, up. I know. I'm going to stir it up some more. I'm going to get some butter. A little bit more. There you go. All right, so now we're just gonna keep on stirring, y'all. Flick of the wrist. Yeah, look at the flick yeah. of the wrist. Hey, not, look at the not, flick of not, the wrist. Not the wrist, the fist. <laughs> that too, whatever. What y'all catch what I'm saying. Throw this away from me, baby doll. Thank you. You want the. Baby doll loves being in the kitchen, helping out and watching, y'all. Mm-hmm. And what kind of seasoning you want to put up in here? Whatever whatever you choose. Oh, I was thinking Creole. Y'all see that? How is it looking, y'all? Am I doing a good job? Yep. Okay, y'all. We putting garlic powder and onion powder into the mashed potatoes. We're also putting Creole seasoning and parsley flakes. So yes, if you want yours to be well seasoned and looking like this, then definitely season yours with uh, these seasonings. And then we're just gonna stir all that in there. I love those. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that steam that's coming from it, y'all. All right, y'all, so for the sauce, what you're gonna do, don't wash out your pan, because you wanna leave those drippings in there. So don't wash out the pan, keep that in there. And I'm going to use um, a whole pint of heavy whipping cream. Let me turn this on low. And then we're going to put some butter in here. Um, Let's put some butter. Don't quote me on the butter, y'all. I, I say a stick of butter. Just use like a stick of butter. You want to use a little bit of uh, lemon juice. Not too much. Just a tad bit. Okay, that's enough. And then you just want to stir that on in there. And that's going to create your sauce to put on your uh, heavy whipping cream. I mean, to put on your salmon and your mashed potatoes. You let that heat on up in there. Do you pour it over your salmon and your mashed potatoes and let it marinate? You think we need some more butter? Yeah, you want. I'm gonna just add a little bit of uh, a little bit more butter, y'all. And see, it's easy to make the sauce from scratch. You just let that a butter melt on into it. Let it simmer for a few minutes. And once it start bubbling, then it's ready to uh, it's ready to be poured over your salmon and your mashed potatoes. Okay, y'all. So this is how y'all want y'all um sauce to look. You want it to be bubbling 
and and you want to uh taste it while it's you know simmering to make sure it's seasoned enough we have to go ahead and add more seasoning to it we had to add a little more lemon juice and now it tastes to perfection y'all so now it's ready to be poured over the salmon and the mashed potatoes so let's go ahead and fix our plate okay y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and uh fix my plate i'm trying to see where i want to start at first i guess i'll start with the broccoli Y'all, I made the broccoli too soft. <laughs> I wanted it to stay on the stem. It broke apart, but oh well, it's still gonna get eight. I ain't no perfect plater now, y'all. I'm still learning how to plate my uh food perfectly. But we still gonna have it looking good. Y'all want me to fix y'all plate? Let me know in the comment section. <laughs> Cause I show sure fix y'all plate. I don't know how it's going to get to y'all. I'm going to mail it to y'all. Hopefully the mailman don't uh, eat y'all plate before it gets to y'all. <laughs> then we're going to go ahead and put our fish on here. I want this piece right here. This piece look crisp. How you say it? Crisp. I'm going to give me two pieces of fish. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna add a little bit more mashed potatoes, y'all, because I'm hungry. And I'm gonna taste test it for y'all, too. Let y'all know how my honest opinion of how I did. So now we're gonna take the, um, this is the, the salt. I finna say heavy whipping cream. <laughs> I be getting tongue tied. And we can just gonna pour a little bit on the salmon and on the mashed potatoes. Ooh, trying to show it so y'all can see. Ooh, how they look, y'all? Let me know. All right, now let's eat. This is mine right here, y'all. Oh, yeah, that's pure I plate. I like cheese on mine, so. Do y'all like cheese on y'all broccoli and mashed potatoes? I know I don't. Who plate look better? Comment and let us know. My feelings ain't gonna be hurt if y'all say pure's. <laughs> hey, I tried. He fixed a plate better than me. I told him he should have went to uh, cooking plate. I mean... Culinary arts class. Yeah, I'm all right. I ain't, I ain't all that. <laughs> yeah, y'all see it? I, I probably put a, for him. I probably put a little cheese on there. All right, y'all. So let's go ahead and taste it. Lord, thank you for this food that we're about to receive. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. All right, let's see. I can taste the seasoning. It's not too salty. It ain't unseasoned. It's uh, crisp just how I like it. Yeah. We did that. Let's go ahead. Y'all want some? Here y'all go. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, and then I definitely got some uh, raspberry lemonade, y'all. I'm drinking it in a wine glass because this is a classy meal. So we want to use a wine glass and drink classy too. <laughs> mm hmm Okay, let's try the broccoli too. Oh yeah, this is so good. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. Y'all, if y'all have tried this recipe, let me know, y'all. I I really want y'all to try it. It is so good. Cook it just how I cook it. You're going to love it. So, I'm going to finish chowing down on this meal. And yeah, y'all, I hope that y'all have a blessed night, a blessed day. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all new to the channel, click that subscribe button. Comment down below. Let me know that y'all new to the channel. You're going to love it here. You're going to uh, see more cooking vlogs like this. So, if you enjoyed this cooking vlog, definitely subscribe. Share it to your friends, to your family. Tell everybody to come subscribe to our channel, okay? So, <clears throat> I hope y'all have a blessed night and a blessed day, like I had said. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, y'all. Peace. Peace out.